The warm and dry weather is expected to stick around, but as we go into the weekend, moisture will begin to increase. Our meteorologist Justin Ballard from the UF Weather Center. Those moisture levels will begin to rise this weekend as southerly winds make a comeback. But we've got a cold front set to move through our area Monday into Tuesday of next week, and that will help to dry things out considerably. You see those shades of brown behind me indicating the drier air. But this weekend, while we do have rain chances, it will not be a washout. So if you have any outdoor plans, I think we'll be okay to have them. Saturday looks to stay dry. It's Sunday where the chance for showers make a return. A few showers, maybe a rumble or two of thunder, but notice future track here, not too optimistic on widespread shower or storm chances. Slightly higher chances for rain and thunderstorms for our friends in the Panhandle by Monday morning. A cold front will be sitting right about here over the northern Gulf, and that will be sliding into north central Florida through the day Monday, keeping the chance for a few scattered showers and storms locally. Not tomorrow, though. We'll start the day with some patchy fog, temperatures around 60, a mix of sun and clouds tomorrow afternoon around the noon hour, and mostly sunny skies by the 4 o'clock hour with temperatures into the middle 70s. In terms of our forecast for tomorrow, 76 at forecast high in Gainesville, 78 in Ocala and Bronson. A little bit warmer, though, as we get into your Thursday. 81 from Bronson to Ocala, 82 in the villages. Still holding on to upper 70s in Gainesville, but we'll be mighty close to that 80 degree mark. I think we'll hit 80 degrees Friday, Saturday into Sunday even. Again, that chance for showers and thunderstorms arrives late in the weekend and into early next week.